This case considered the issue of professional misconduct and whether or not a solicitor who fraudulently charged a client and failed to inform them that they could recover the costs from the client's employer was guilty of professional misconduct and was unfit to practice. In this case, a solicitor acted for a client in a compensation matter and the client was awarded the sum of $43,000. The solicitor informed the client that his costs were $3,000 but failed to inform the client that he could claim his costs from the client's employer, which he later did. The man had argued that it was an isolated incident of overcharging and would not be regarded as disgraceful or dishonourable by his brethren of good repute and competency. He also admitted that he had felt pressure to contribute to the gross income of the firm at the time. The solicitor was fined $10,000, but the Law Society appealed and argued that the solicitor was not fit to practice and sought an order that his name be removed from the role. The central issue for the court was whether or not the solicitor's actions were sufficient to find him unfit to practice.